Hey, welcome back to Mashups. If you are going to buy this Pixel 6 phone, or if you already have a Pixel 6 phone, there are a couple of tips that's gonna improve the battery life and Pixel phone performance. We are gonna discuss those tips on today's video. If you see any considerable battery drain on your Pixel 6 phone, or if you see any performance issue, the quick fix is change your network type. Most probably, you have selected a 5G network automatically on your phone. Of course, the 5G is providing a lot of speed, but at the same time, it's drawing a lot of battery power from your phone and the resource. So if you want a battery life for the time being, better you switch from 5G to some other network type. Go to your settings, network and internet, sims, scroll down and prefer network type and switch from 5G to LTE or the other network type to get a more battery life. This would be the number one priority if you wanna save your battery life and increase the performance of the phone. Do you have your fingerprint sensing problem and it's not quick enough or it's immediately switching to the lock screen? There's a quick fix for this. What I did, I added two fingerprint for the same finger and now it's working almost perfect. Let's have a look. Go to settings, scroll down for security and fingerprint unlock. And here you can add up to four fingerprints and I added two prints for the same finger and it's increasing sensitivity. And additional one more tip I would say, if the fingerprint is not sensing, you have to just press harder and sometimes it's work. When you make a call from your phone, definitely it's going through your provider. And if you can do that through your Wi-Fi, especially you are in a low signal place, and if you don't have that much signal strength to connect your provider, your battery is gonna take more power to get the proper signal. The quick solution for that, use a Wi-Fi calling. Go to calls and SMS, and for the T-Mobile, they're allowing this Wi-Fi calling and make sure you enable that. So if you are at home, and if you don't have that much provider signal out there, the phone will use your Wi-Fi network to make calls and connect the call. That's gonna save some battery, definitely. If you are worried about the battery is charging so quickly, and if you are not getting the battery life, at least for one day with your new Pixel phone, just to try these tips. There are a couple of tips you can do in battery settings to get maximum battery life while you use your Pixel phone. Let's have a look. The first thing, if you see any unusual battery drainage, come to this screen and go to battery usage. And here you can see what are the apps that drained your battery for the past couple of hours. And for example, Ufi security is the number one. It's getting a lot of notifications when the camera detected the motion. If you want to get rid of this app by taking more battery from it, they have a couple of solutions there. You can force a stop and that's not applicable for this particular application. So you can have a restricted battery use. The app will limit the usage and the background running resources. So you can make sure that only the important apps are draining your battery and all other apps you can put to this restricted mode for battery usage. The second tip for saving the battery is the battery saver. And here you can enable the battery saver based on a schedule or your Pixel phone can automatically learn how to save the battery or you can set a percentage. And there is one more tip, a stream battery saver. This is an additional layer to save your battery and you can select when you want to use this one. And when the battery will turn on, you can select this option automatically turn on or it will ask you every time before it turn on this Stream battery saver. And in this Stream battery saver, you can pick what are the apps you want to run while you selected this Stream battery saver. Adaptive preferences. I would say every Pixel user must turn on this feature. The first one is adaptive charger. Instead of a quick charging while you connect your phone, especially when you charge this phone during the night, it will steadily increase the battery charge instead of short charging cycle. 
and this is going to expand the battery life further so i would recommend to turn on this adaptive charging for all the phones and adaptive battery the phone will learn from your patterns and it will control the battery based on your phone usages and if you are a new pixel user keep in mind that this will work after one or two weeks because the phone will take its own time to learn your pattern then it will start to adjust your battery usage accordingly and restricted apps if you think there are a couple of apps that's draining battery while running the background you can add those apps in the list and they will block from running in background and draining your battery you know the display on your phone has a major role in draining the battery of your phone you can have a couple of tilts that's going to definitely save the battery of your pixel phone let's check those and the first one is the brightness level this is for the shooting purpose otherwise i just recommend to keep this screen brightness maybe 40 to 50 or whatever the percentage that you look convenient for you and there is an additional thing adaptive brightness make sure to turn this on so whenever you go to sunlight or dark room the phone will automatically adjust the brightness of the screen and there is an another setting that you can consider on the low screen if you scroll down you can see wake screen for notifications so think about it, you are getting a bunch of notifications every day and you have to turn on this feature to wake up the screen for all the notifications so definitely the phone is going to spend more battery power for waking up your phone for every notification so you better to turn this off screen timeout this is an additional option that demands your battery so it is better to have set for 30 seconds or one minute for your screen timeout even you can set 15 seconds if you are comfortable there is an additional settings if you want to dim your screen extra other than the brightness you set here so go to accessibility and extra dim if you turn on this feature this is going to extra dim your screen and you can control the intensity here how much dimmer you want so this is an additional option if you want to get very less brightness on your screen the data usage that's going to consume some battery especially you are in a low signal location so there are a couple of things you can do to save the battery and the data at the same time on your pixel sys phone turn on this data saver and tap on this and you can restrict if you think any app is consuming your data while you drive and that's going to save some battery definitely the location permission for all apps that's not necessary some of the apps you need to give the location permission only while they are using and some of the apps even you don't need the location permission so you have to choose wisely to give the location permission of the apps on your phone and definitely whenever any apps are using location permission in background or while you open it's gonna drain your battery so do some tips over there go to location see the apps that recently used your location and if you think any of other apps are using your location you can turn that off and i can see some of the apps that i allowed all the time and you can switch this one to allow while using the app if you see any apps that's using all the time your location some of the apps that may need to use your location all the time so you can give the permission there and remove the apps that's using your location all the time that's gonna save some battery and last but least if you have a pixel pro or pixel 6 you can reduce the screen refresh rate on your phone settings that might save some battery life maybe it's not going to contribute that much percentage on battery saving but still it's better than nothing if you really don't want to use that much refresh rate or if you are not a gamer you can change that settings and switch back the screen refresh rate to 60 hertz go to your phone settings display and tap on this maximum refresh rate and select 60 hertz this might be an another tip that's going to save some battery juice 
If you think you don't have any option to charge the battery for a while or if you think your phone is gonna run out of battery within few hours, the best solution just to go there and scroll down and switch your phone into a battery saver mode. And you may notice that all your phone icon and everything will gray out except to some essential apps like a camera, phone or messaging app. Those apps would be live other than that all other apps will be gray out. None of those apps are allowed to work in the background or consume the battery from the phone. And just in case, if you want to open one of the apps to check something and you can still temporarily use that app for a while. So you can select OK or unpause temporarily. Now you will be able to open that app and use for a temporary purpose. So this is a nice addition and this is going to temporarily disable all the apps until you quit from this battery saver and definitely that's gonna save your battery for a while until you get the charger for the next time. Thank you for watching this video and I hope definitely these tips are going to improve the battery life and the performance of your new Pixel phone. If you have any questions, let us know in comments. And if you want to know more tips about the Pixel phone, you can check the video here. And please don't forget to subscribe our channel and press the bell icon. We'll see you on another video soon.